short and sweet. You might have seen that the chat GPT bot can create code. And here I give uh, him or her, the, the bot, a code instruction, create a Python script for Autodesk Maya 2020.4, which does a nice job. That's very open. Let's see what the uh, chatbot does. Uh, certainly, here is an example, Python script for Autodesk Maya 2020.4 that creates a simple 3D cube and displays it in the viewport. In grey you see the code instructions and the actual code is in white, green and pink. And uh, this is real time as the chat GPT develops that code. It's finished already. The script creates a cube using the polycube command, so it's going to be a polygon cube. My question was pretty open. Now, um, I don't want to apply this, uh, but rather ask a continuing question. Can we make the cube red? Yes, you can change the color of the cube by setting the material properties of the cube's surface. Here's an example of how we can do it with Python in Maya. And here's basically the same code. And Now comes in the material, it's going to be a Lambert node with um, a color of red, which is 100. And now we display the cube in the viewport and it's done. I scroll up, further up, and then I copy that code. And I try it out in Maya using the script editor and we have a python script that's why we use the python section and i have a red cube in many cases it does not work because it maya produces an error message and then you can feed the error messages or error message back in, into the chat gpt script let's uh, do a second example just briefly create a Python script for Maya 2020.4. Uh, I actually use this 2020.4 because I encountered errors uh, because the, um, the bot creates code for other versions of Maya which uh, interpret things differently. So uh, in this case I want a cube of three colors and it needs to think quite a bit actually because many thousands of people are using it at the same time to create a Python script for Maya that creates a cube with three different colors. You can use the following code and here comes the code now. We have the material shading and uh, we have uh, three shaders in this case. Different colors, one zero zero and zero one zero. <laughs> the color zero zero one, as you can see, and now we assign the materials to the faces of the cube. And uh, I did not instruct the bot to use special faces of the cube. Again, an explanation of the code. And now I scroll up again and copy that code. And I paste it in the script editor. It's still a Python script. I can do the same thing with Mel scripts as well. And you see it creates a cube with three colors. Have a nice day.